Well, here we go, folks. The second installment of the fourth season of Countdown to Christmas. So, today, of course, it's going to be another main character. The one and only Lightning McQueen, but in cruising form. Yep, it was the cruising one that was seen at the end of the movie. And we have 11 more days to go until Christmas, folks. I'm so damn excited. Anyways, for starters, the original Cruise of McQueen was released in 2007 as a part of the Movie Moment series, and I believe 2008 as well. And I believe in 2009 or 2010, he got a single, but with lenticular eyes. And he wasn't released until 2013. And this Cruising Lightning McQueen here, whoa, I don't believe has gotten a single release since 2015, the first version of Cruising McQueen. Whereas the gold version here only got released in that Blu-ray exclusive pack with the Metallic Rescue Squad Mater, of which I don't have, unfortunately. But you know, I might get it someday. Oh, and the two Thailand Cruising McQueens. One of them was from the case back in 2020 when COVID hit with Jonas Carvers and Fair Game. And the other was from that five pack with the Thailand Hydraulic Ramon, the red Hydraulic Ramon, not the purple one. Anyways, yeah, the Color Changer only got released. I mean, the Color Changer got released like last year, which we'll get to in a moment. Anyways. First up, this regular Cruise and Lightning McQueen. This is the 2015 version I have in my hands. So it's a little bit chipped. Got the first version back in 2007, but then sold it. Got the lightning bolt there. The tires. A nice metallic finish red paint, though. Really like that metallic red paint. Back lights. got the rims in white walls of course the lightning bolt the windows yep they're a little bit dusty and yeah it's got the blue eyes which i think is accurate to mcqueen I mean, yeah which i think is accurate towards the mcqueen here made in china not thailand yep as you can see it's the 2015 one because of 0235 EAA. Yep, that's the one. Now, they actually made a mistake on this, McQueen. Yep. <clears throat> Sorry about that. Need to clear my throat because of seasonal stuff, of course. Which, yep. They should have done with they should have done it before they did it on the paint mask mcqueen right here as you can see it's got the bumper stickers on the back there yeah might do a review on this mcqueen next year for a countdown to christmas we'll see i'm just gonna put him yeah a little bit we'll put him right next towards the regular cruise mcqueen and the Lightning McQueen with bumper stickers here. I mean, how hard would it have been to put it on the Cruise of McQueen? It's just a simple decal, Mattel. Gosh. Yeah, we'll put them like that, because why not? Anyways, the Golden McQueen here. Yep, this guy has actually gotten a release by Mattel. Like I said, in that Blu-ray pack with the Metallic Rescue Squad Mater. And this guy has actually received a Mini Racer release, of which I'll do a mega unboxing with, a lot, of, along with a lot of other Mini Racers soon. I reviewed this one not too long ago. You could check it out. It's got the gold rims and just a beautiful gold paint job in general. There's nothing quite like it. The backlights. It's just beautiful to look at. Just beautiful to look at. As if 
everyone wishes Mattel would do something like this today. But we just don't get it anymore, do we? Lightning bolt. Of course, the top. 2049 EAB. 204th day of 2009. Made in China and not Thailand. So, yep, this was released back in 2009. It's pretty rare, that McQueen. And if you want it on a good price, then I recommend buying it loose on eBay. It's your best bet at the moment, trust me. Anyways, moving on to the Cruise and Lightning McQueen from Thailand. So, as you can see, yep, I'm just going to use this version of the McQueen because this version that I got back in 2020 is pretty chipped. Yeah. Well, it's nice to have a brand spanking new Lightning McQueen for the cruising theme. Of course, got the blue eyes and the light plate, unfortunately. It's a lot like a racing red. I felt the camera will focus. The smile, the headlights, the side. Whoa. The side with the white walls and the lightning bolt. Yep. The gas cap, camera, got the top with the windows, of course, the major difference is camera, focus, of course, the, Arr, damn it, shit, the camera won't focus, it's cut, stickers that read, Ah, damn it, camera. Sorry. Camera. Mm. Kingman, Barstow, and San Bernardino on the back there. Damn it, camera. Got the white walls, of course, and the lightning bolt. Oh, yeah, let's see if the... Zooming out feature will do it any better. Or zooming in. Yep, as you can see, Kingman, Barstow, and San Bernardino on the back there. Yep. Pretty much does it. Are they a different color variation? That's something I've always wondered. Eh, not really. But they do have different bases, as you can see. This 2022 version, however, doesn't have, like, the little holes to hook into Mater, which that's unfortunate, because I was really hoping they'd do that. Anyways, now on to the last version, which is the Color Changers version, released in the 2021 Mainline series, along with the Fillmore. Yep, the same movie as that Fillmore, which I've done a review on, along with the Snot Rod and Ramon and the King. You can check out that review. Yep. And here's the version that I have in the package here because, um, well, my dad went to Target once and found this. Even though he thought I didn't have it, so he just decided to pick it up anyway. Why? But in all seriousness, I'm really happy to have another McQueen in the package because you can never have too many of him for my liking. Of course, you could see he changes from black to red here. Now, mine has gotten a little bit charcoal colored in a way, like a fire red color, like a burnt lightning McQueen in a way. Anyways, that is going to be pretty much it for the Countdown to Christmas review on the Cruise and Lightning McQueen for you all. Let me know which Cruise and Lightning McQueen is your favorite down in the comments. And yet, you can keep suggesting away until the 24th. Yep, the 24th is going to be the last day. So you guys can keep suggesting until the 24th. So anyways, I'll see you guys in a bit for the review of Dat's Jammin' here. Cannot wait to review this guy. He looks sick. So I'll see you guys then. Goodbye. Thanks for watching. And as always, peace.